pizza for breakfast. This will warm me up. I am so thankful that I'm not in my tent this morning. It's been drizzling, raining all night. The looks of outside do not look friendly. It's hard to get motivated <laughs> at this moment. So I'm gonna sit here for a, a while longer, take a little, take a, a later start today. Oh God. All I wanna do is sit on one of these chairs and read a book today. <laughs> it looks so cozy. Can you hear the rain? So there's a winter storm warning in effect today, but then tomorrow it gets better. I just gotta make it through one more day. But boy, is it hard waking up after not a whole lot of sleep into the cold and knowing that I'm gonna go get wet. All right, you're looking battle worn. Ooh, all right. My butt is so sore, not just sore, but we're talking open saddle sores. This needs to get under control soon. Let's see how this feels. Oh yeah, oh gosh. Oh, it's like sitting on hot coals. Oh boy. Here we go, here we go. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. This was absolutely epic. I needed this, I needed this cozy spot right here. Let's go have a good one. All right. No crashies, no flatties, no whammies. Day five, here we go. Heading out into the boonies, up and over some passes. I was just riding my bike all alone, feeling like, oh man, these mornings are tough. And then this guy shows up. Yeah, man. Yeah, rocking the U2. <laughs> Love oh, it. How you feeling today? Oh man, it's gonna be. Let's see. Let's not put any copyright infringement. Okay. So, <laughs> so I wake up this morning trying to catch up with you, like we talked yesterday. Yeah. And like 20 minutes in, I re I realize I forgot my heart my heart rate monitor. Oh no. So came back. So last 45 minutes. Bummer. Play played in my mind a bit, but. Like I always say to myself is, the worst part is the best part because those are the best stories. Exactly. Nobody cares when it's sunshine and perfect. Everybody loves good stories. I love sunshine and perfect. <laughs> well, we're glad to see you, buddy. Yeah, me too. There goes Gabriel. He's too fast for me. Yeah. He's trying to stay warm. And too much butt sore. And too many butt sores. Don't sit down. <laughs> I'm not going to sit down either. Maybe that's the key. Never sit down. We're dancing in the rain. You cannot stop. With this song, Woo. you cannot, cannot stop. This song gets you going, baby. <laughs> <laughs> but uh. when, when there's a, a lot of bears mm. and you really want to scare them, I put Justin Bieber. <laughs> discography, the whole thing. And they just <laughs> run away, man. <laughs> All the classic, baby. Yes. <laughs> the rain is really coming down now. I have all of my waterproof stuff on, socks, pants, gloves, temperature is dropping. I am so glad Gabrielle is with me. What a wonderful day. Oh man. What a wonderful day. Oh, you're from Quebec and you're used to cold weather riding. I'm used to Baja. <laughs> yeah, but if it wasn't for, for the Tour Divide, I don't think we would be out there right now. No. No, no way. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, Kind of miserable, but we're gonna get through it, my brother. Yeah. Together. <laughs> I seriously feel so much better. It's so much better to be with someone. Yeah. Oh yeah. A lot safer. Uh, alone I would be like, ah uh, yeah. <laughs> I would be on the edge a bit. <laughs> a bit more on the edge. Yeah, it's not, it's not over. Yeah. But we're doing, we're doing great. just both moaning together 
Just oh, screaming. Screaming. We're frozen. Frozen uh, and wet. Pain. Pain. It hurts. Like, and to be honest, like, this is survival stuff. I mean, if you have a mechanical now, yeah. alone, that could be bad, man. Really bad. It's on the edge. Yeah. Oh, God. I am so uncomfortable right now. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, the idea of just putting up my tent and calling it a day is yeah. tempting. But it's the kind of weather you have you have to keep going. Yeah. If you stop for five minutes, you have to go. You, yeah, you yeah. just keep going. This yeah. is the worst so far. Yeah, oh yeah. Right? Yeah, for sure. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I thought Canada was uncomfortable with the rain and the snow. Nothing my compared Canada. to this. Every time we get kind of comfortable, a little bit dry, a little bit warm, the rain starts again. But I'm with my buddy. We're good. Oh, this spot right here brings back good memories. I camped right there in 2020. And it was nice and warm and hot. A little different than today. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Look at that. That's a cool spot. That's not bad, right next to the river. Wow. <laughs> Woo. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, it feels so good. Woo. You probably won't believe me, but it's 9 p.m. and it's still essentially daylight out. <laughs> I'm gonna try to fall asleep. We'll see if that works, but what a great day. You can hear the birds chirping. We can take our... Oh, we can take our hoodies off? Yeah, hoodies off. It's a little bit warmer. First Ooh. sun rays of the day. I know. Oh, good job getting through that. That was tough. That was so tough. Oh, wow. What a journey. <laughs> Gabriel wants to see how heavy my bike is. So, so I tried to lift it up and I just can't. <laughs> I just can't. So what you're saying is it's heavier than your bike? So... I just said earlier that I didn't have any respect for this guy, <laughs> any, until now. <laughs> until I try to <laughs> lift that up. Yeah, I bring a I, lot of stuff. I mean, you have your camera equipment and stuff, but yeah. this is, <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! I've got the official Tour Divide DJ with me. Yeah, buddy. All day, every day, man. <laughs> You know, I've never ridden with music or earbuds or anything, but I gotta say, on a day like today, when we're suffering a bit, it's nice to have some good tunes. How we doing, my brother? Man, it's uh, it's gonna be a long day. Not just because of the weather, but we're covering some miles for sure. Yeah. Oh yeah. Every day. So I just stopped back there to apply some chamois cream, squirrel's nut butter to be exact. I have two open saddle sores and they are excruciating. <laughs> Oh man, this usually doesn't happen, huh? I really don't understand what's going on. But uh, yeah, I'm getting tested in just about every way. But we're gonna make it. We're gonna make these things heal. Cause no saddle store is gonna stop me from finishing this ride. So we are feeling sun right now. How does it feel, buddy? Dude, it, it's like when your phone is on the point of dying and you <laughs> plug it in into a wall with fast charging, <laughs> this is it. Yeah, oh, and I know it's not gonna last for long. It's still very <laughs> cloudy up there, but man. A little boost. A little boost for sure. Thank you, sun. <laughs> oh, that warmth <laughs> means so much to me. <laughs> it's the little things. Warming up my body, warming up my soul, warming up my attitude. Hey, hey. Oh, God. Mm. 
So it's 2 p.m. I've ridden 50 miles. He's ridden further. Sealy Lake is another 50 miles up and over a giant mountain called Richmond Peak. And uh, there are hotels there. There's also a 70% chance of rain from 4 to 10 p.m. And Richmond Peak is real high, so that rain would probably be snow. We have uh, decided that we're just gonna go as far as we can and be smart. And if it gets cold and miserable like this morning, we're just gonna stop and put up our tents and call it a day. How do you feel about that? I feel like we said we're gonna do the Tour Divide, we're doing it the Tour Divide. <laughs> Not the alternate route, the Tour Divide. But we're gonna be smart about it. Yeah. Yeah. We don't wanna take any unnecessary risks. And you know, take our bikes up through a snowstorm till midnight, <laughs> not worth it. The rain is back, a lot of rain. How we doing though? Uh. Wait for the moment. Let's see in an hour. Yeah. It's not as cold because we're at low, lower altitudes than, than where we were earlier today, but the goal is to go up and over a mountain today. So we'll see what the conditions are as we get closer. The one positive of the situation is that the rain is washing off my muddy pants. <laughs> That's true. Let's do it. Let's do it. Look who we found. It's Alyssa. How you doing, girl? I'm cold and I'm angry. <laughs> How are you? I would say I'm pretty cold and angry too. Yeah. <laughs> this is, we have, I've had enough of this. We've been in the freezing rain for, I don't know, like six hours today, maybe? Yeah. Something like that. And then yesterday, and the day before, and the day before. Yeah, on and off. Pretty cold, like 30 degrees. We just saw a bear. Yeah. yeah. But it's like the whole package. Yeah. Yeah. But we're really close to the highway. Yeah. And we have a good gang with good vibes. So. Yeah, we do. We got a good gang. Yeah. yeah Who were the three best friends that anyone could have? It feels good to let out some howls. Man, I've been so tight and so tense for the past few days. Oh, I need to let it out. So we just emerged from the rainstorm alley and look at my bike. This thing, look? this thing really is good. as dirty as it gets. Yeah. yeah, how do you look? How's your really face? Really good. Oh, your I face feel looks good. beautiful. How much yeah. dirt do you have on your face? I don't know, man. I, I don't know. We all have dirty bikes. At this point. Look at my look at my yeah. rain pants. Oh my god. <laughs> we are at the point that you cannot put a layer on top of it. No. Like there's yeah. not much that. There's nothing They're not gonna let us in into any restaurants. No. <laughs> <laughs> So we're riding down this uh, hill here, wondering what we're gonna do with ourselves. We're a little bit low on food, and uh, we we might that. have some we might have some trail magic here. We will see. Bean oh, burrito, baby. What you brought bean burritos? <laughs> oh my god, you're amazing! <laughs> what was your name? Dave Dave Connery. Dave, thank you so. You just saved the day. <laughs> Let's see this. I want to see it with my own eyes. This is like perfect timing. Oh my gosh, oh my <laughs> gosh, oh my dear Lord, you're amazing. This is the best burrito I've ever had in my life, Dave. <laughs> you saved the day. Yeah. We Thanks, were just man. literally up there talking up the road about what we're gonna do because we were so low on food. Yep. And then you just came up out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> What's your story? I've been following you online and uh, I thought, well, if there's ever a chance to meet Ryan, it's going to be out in the middle of the woods, way out in the middle of Montana. <laughs> and so I took off this morning, and uh, on the way, I went by a Mexican restaurant, and I bought a burrito for you, because I know you love burritos. Uh, yes, I do. And uh, what better place? Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much. Seriously, this is what makes it all 
<laughs> worth it. You know, it's like when I make the videos, I don't know who's on the other end of them. And then it's like, it's so impactful to meet people in real life. Yeah. Well, you've helped a lot of people get out and get on their bikes. So well, get out and get on your bike. That's right. Thank you, buddy. Yeah. Cheers. Thank Man, you. oh, thank you so much. You uh, I feel so much better now. A belly full of beans makes yeah. life better, even though it's cold and it's going to be a cold the, night. Survive the snow of Montana. <laughs> and tomorrow it's getting nicer, right? Yeah. All right. 70 degrees tomorrow. Oh, yes. I can't wait. Oh, that Dave guy was such a sweet, sweet man. Warmed me up. Feeling good. I think we're gonna go to a campground here pretty close and call it a day. It's been brutal. All right, we did it, buddy. What? Couldn't have done it without you. Oh. You were definitely a huge amount of moral support all day. And I would have not done it without you either, man. <laughs> Congrats. Oh, God, what Does. a day. Those and days, I'm I'm gonna remember this one. Yeah, we'll always remember these for days. a lot of reasons. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's always the hard days to remember. Now it's raining. I wish there was a bath or a pavilion or something. But, but oh well. Hello. Woo. So we were gonna put our tents tents up over there, but then we saw these uh, bathrooms. They're locked, so nobody's gonna be coming into them. This, this is the Tour de Vite spirit right there, man. Yeah, man, I like your apartment. <laughs> it's perfect. And we're protected from all the rain. A bit small, but we can make it. Yeah, work. yeah, there's enough room to lay down right here next to my uh, my disgusting bicycle. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm just going to put the tent in an angle. Have like the feet kind of in the rain or something, but we we should be great. I mean, the floor is perfectly flat. This yeah, that's is, true. Look at that flat floor. Like, this is one of the yeah. That's a good advantage uh, advantage right there. But uh, it's kind of funny, you know, when you think about it. It's kind of funny. <laughs> it is funny. <laughs> All this is funny. Yeah, I am so glad that we got here when we did because it is pouring. And we have a roof. It doesn't smell awesome, but we are dry. And there's my buddy <laughs> having a little picnic. We have our, our our own room, man. Yeah, I know. We each have a room. A separate room. Yeah. The sunshine on my face feels so good in that view. Is incredible. What a day. Oh my gosh. What a crazy five days. The weather has definitely made it a lot harder than I had anticipated. But also, on the same note, a lot more meaningful and valuable. You know, I always get the most when I push myself and I go into uncomfortable situations. And this has been a lot of uncomfortable, but also a good mix of beautiful as well, of course. Like, look where I am, look at the people I've been meeting and look at the wonderful people along, along the road have been coming out to say hi to me. It's been absolutely incredible. And I'm really glad that Gabrielle rode with me today. It was good to have some camaraderie and then Alyssa toward the end of the day. Gabrielle just has just such a great spirit about him, just so positive and wise, you know, maybe it's like that Canadian French thing, but he's got all the right things to say. And uh, there's no doubt I would have been a little spooked if I was on my own today, riding through all that weather and cold. And uh, oh, I'm so glad that we're here right now. <laughs> and the sun just broke finally, which means I think we're gonna have good weather for a while. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time. My mom back home has been texting me saying, you just gotta get through these next few days. The forecast looks good after Tuesday. So here we go. Wow. I'm gonna sleep well tonight for sure. And then uh, get on my bike again. <laughs> Cause that's what I came here to do. Oh, what a beautiful life. And it makes it easier, makes it easier to go to sleep knowing that I'm gonna wake up in the morning and it's not going to be raining on me. Feeling full of gratitude right now. You know when you uh, 
you push yourself through th- something hard and you accomplish something, you'd feel like, all right, I did it. I gained some confidence. I feel good. And uh, that's what today was all about, even though we only went 70 miles. Only 70. So I might be having my lowest low of the trip so far. This is unbelievably difficult for me right now. 